What's going on, Imperials? It's Emperor Cubone here. We're back with Let's Go Eevee, and as promised, we were going to fight Mina. How about a Kentonian trainer? Gonna battle my fairy Pokemon? Then here I go! You're going to learn how great fairy type Pokemon can be. Surely she doesn't have a Lolan Pokemon on her team, right? Like she doesn't have a Ribombi or anything. Okay, it's a Jigglypuff. Okay. We're fine. No need to freak out. <laughs> uh, okay. Gonna scald this Jigglypuff. Because we don't, uh... Well, we have one Poison-type move, and it is Poison Sting, which is not a very high base power. It's a lot of double slapping. Hopefully we can get that burn. In case we get four or more next time. So it won't do as much. Oh, whew. It's, uh... We avoided Sing. I did buy some Awakenings from all that money we got on the boat because, uh, I was sick of the sleep from last time. Uh, which, uh, I guess brings me to the Inquisition of the day, which is, what is your least favorite status condition? Mine, uh, would either be sleep or, if you count it, Infatuation. Because Infatuation seems like it somehow is worse than any other, like, there's no official way to break out of Infatuation other than switching out. You know? And it's like, it gives you the option to, uh, maybe do an attack, except not really. You can't actually do an attack. Oh, no! Okay, we gotta switch. I put up a light screen, so... I'm gonna switch to... Mew? No, switch to Eevee. No. <sighs> this is hard, but I'm gonna switch to Mew. Because if it uses another Psychic-type attack, we will resist it. I was thinking since Eevee had Bite, but it's a Fairy-type as well as Psychic-type, so Bite's only neutrally effective. So we might as well use other neutrally effective moves. That did a lot of damage. Okay. Light Screen is up, so we're going to use Headbutt. Maybe we should Thunder Wave it. No. Okay, we can flinch. We could do para flinching with Mew. How did I just realize that? Flinch? No, Psy Wave. Okay, we can take another Psy Wave. Light Screen wore off. That doesn't matter. We have Headbutt. Mina is thoroughly uninterested in this whole ordeal. Okay. Nice. Getting lots of experience. Charmeleon's level 22. Ivysaur's 23, nice. Beat Mina. I'm shocked at your strength. Got lots of money. And a bottle cap! Alright! Alola for the win! Oh, wonderful! You and your Pokemon battling side by side. Now that's a great composition. I'd love to draw a picture of you two. Go ahead. I'm all for it. I can't go back to Alola until I defeat you? <laughs> just kidding. But let's battle again sometime. Okay, for sure. I'll I'll battle any uh, trial captains that want to come my way. Also, is Lily here? I heard she was coming to Kanto. Uh, so if she's here, just like uh, just let me know. Okay, we're gonna heal up and hit the gym, and by that I mean the Pokemon gym and never the human gym. Not never, but gyms cost money. Right? Like, you can work out on your own, if you want. My brother always says the best uh, best exercise equipment you can buy is an axe. And that way you just uh, take your axe out in the forest and go chop down a tree. And then chop it into firewood. That'll give you a pretty good workout. Speaking of chopping down trees with an axe, Eevee's about to chop down this tree. Yo! Beyond this point's of Vermilion City Gym. But you'll need to chop down the tree first. Yeah, I can. But I think you and Eevee will have no trouble slicing through. Go on, give it a shot. 
I was about to until you started talking. Seems like this tree can be chopped down. You want to use your secret technique chopped down? Yes, I do. Go, Eevee. Boom. Did it. Good work. You chopped down that troublesome tree and opened the way to the gym. And that means you can challenge the gym now. I'll be waiting there for you. Does it replace itself like uh, like the cut trees always did? Or is it more like uh, strength in the newer generations? Because I really, really like how strength is in the newer generations. Uh, I meant to check the sign, but I don't like this puzzle. Nobody likes this puzzle. Why is this puzzle here? Also, his gym looks really kind of rinky-dink this way. I've been waiting for you, Champ of the Making. Lieutenant Surge here is the gym leader in this city. He's an expert in electric Pokemon and a real tough guy. Flying and water type Pokemon don't do well against some electric types. What's the stipulation here? Is there one? You also want to watch so your Pokemon don't get stuck paralyzed. Here's my last tip. Lieutenant Surge is a, the cautious type. He's put barriers between himself and the rest of the room, so it won't be easy getting to him. Lieutenant Surge... Ugh, Tracy, stupid. I think there's more in the audience this time, or maybe there's just less seating. Okay, the tree did grow back. The Lightning Lieutenant. It doesn't say the Lightning American anymore. That's, uh... That's, uh... You know, not good. Are the red and blue trash cans the right ones? Who's that guy with the megaphone? That's an interesting trainer class. This is no place for kids, not even if you're good at Pokemon. It, it is, though. It's a gym, like Sailor Dwayne. You're a sailor! What are you even doing here? Why does a sailor have a Magnemite? Okay. We did put Dig on Wartortle, so I'm going to try it. I'm going to risk everything and use Dig on this Magnemite. Nice. Thundershock. We avoided the attack. Use Dig successfully connected. Instant KO. Nice. Excellent, excellent work, War Turtle. Great job. We beat Sailor Dwayne. Wow, you surprised me. Yeah, you're gonna take that what you said about me being a kid? I'm really curious about this trainer class. I'm a lightweight, but I'm good with electricity. That's why I joined this gym. Okay. Rocker Bailey. Rocker has a microphone with a weird antenna on it? I think, I feel like that's different in Japan somehow, but whatever. Go, Wartortle! Okay, there's no way Wartortle's faster than a Voltorb. So we're gonna switch, just straight switch to Ivysaur, who will resist the electric hits, and uh, <coughs> should be able to tank Anything other than some sonic booming. Thundershock. Okay, that's fine. Nice. Uh, we're gonna poison powder, actually. Self-destruct! Oh, no! Good thing this isn't a Nuzlocke. Oh, uh, well, we tanked it. It's fine. I love Ivysaur. It's so defensive. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no. Don't... don't switch. Um, if this one blows up, fine, but we're just gonna Vine Whip it. it you swift! Okay. If it gets me down low enough, another self-destruct will take me out. Yeah, if it self-destructs this next turn... Oh! We killed it! Nice crit! Nice crit, okay. Nice, excellent, excellent work. Eh. Uh, fried. Rocker, Bailey. Okay, one last guy. Hello, my kind sir. When I was in the army, Lieutenant Surge was my strict CO. He was a hard taskmaster. So he was your CO, but you're older than him? Gentleman Tucker. Uh, he either must have been really good, or you must have not been very good. Or, uh, you just like your position. That's 
also possible. Thunder Wave. Oh no! And I use Dig. It's a two-turn move. <sighs> Should have known Pikachu would have outsped me. Okay, we we were paralyzed. It's fine. Uh, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna switch to Eevee. Like we're not we're not gonna mess around with this. We're gonna Eevee it up. I'm gonna gonna Swift it. I used to have Quick Attack, but I changed it out for Swift. Boom. It didn't use Quick Attack again, which does concern me. Yeah, Thunder Wave, I figured. Okay, so we're definitely going to heal and then come back, finish the puzzle, or start the puzzle, I guess. We've just been battling. but uh, And then Fight Surge, get us a Thunder Badge. A full Restore, are you kidding me? This isn't even the Gym Leader. Okay, we weren't paralyzed, that's fine. Kind of wish it was a crit. Oh! <gasps> Yes, Eevee, I love you. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Eevee broke through the paralysis because we pet it so much. It also found a thing earlier, by the way, when I was petting it. We beat Gentleman Tucker. Oh, you're very good. Yes, I am. Okay. So back to the center. Surge, we'll be back for you in a minute. Sure, that's very boring for the audience to just sit there and wait for me to go heal. Yes, chop it down. Okay. I'm gonna go heal. And, uh. Brock was the same, but Misty was different. So is Surge, like, just a Raichu? Like from the anime, or does he have more? Like from the game. I mean, it is a yellow version remake, so I guess he could just have a Raichu by itself. Um, uh, War Turtle doesn't need to be in front for the gym battle. Uh, Ivysaur will be in front. We're gonna lead with our best foot forward. Uh, War Turtle's still out of the Pokeball, though. That's a little trippy, but we'll get used to it. Okay, chop it down, and fight Surge. Okay, the trash cans are the same. It's a red trash can. It's a blue trash can. Hey, there's a switch. Let's push it. Okay, got that first one. First electric barrier was deactivated. No, nope, there's only trash here. Oh my goodness. <sighs> this is the worst puzzle ever. Why in the Haas would they not change it? They changed so many other things. Okay, good. Whew. Fight Surge, baby. Get badge number three. Tin Hut! Welcome to Vermilion City Gym. Will you look at that? A pint sized challenger. Ha ha ha! You've got a big, brassy nerve to take me on with your puny power. The Pokemon battle is war! I'll show you, civilian. I'll shock you into surrender! He didn't mention anything about the Great Pokemon War. Gym Leader Lieutenant Surge. So now to Voltorb, okay. So he does have multiple Pokemon. Um, uh, I really don't want it to explode. But we're going to Leech Seed it anyway. Light Screen, okay. Leech Seed was the right call. Not bad, not bad. Um... All of, our, all of Ivysaur's moves are physical anyway, so Light Screen will not deter us. Uh, Vine Whip. Thunderbolt. Oh, wow. Are we going to get the Thunderbolt TM? We can teach Mew Thunderbolt for sure. Nice. Okay. Oh, yeah. Getting that Leech Seed health back. Liking that. Liking that. 
Um, I'm guessing Raichu and Magnemite are the other two Pokemon. Thunderbolt again. Okay, not bad, not bad. Just keeping off the paralysis, good. Okay, one more Vine Whip will do it in. Um, hopefully it won't just self-destruct. Okay, good. Please don't paralyze, please don't paralyze. Nice. Ivysaur's the best. Great work, Ivysaur. Since you're about to send in Magnemite, will you switch Pokemon? Yes, I will. I'm going to use Charmeleon. And I'm going to dig. I would use War Turtle, but it's not worth it. Because it probably knows Thunderbolt too. Like, um... <clears throat> uh... I think that's probably the TM that we're going to get, so... That's generally what uh, the gym leader does, is spam whatever TM they are going to give you. Yep, see? Thunderbolt. Light screen wore off. Okay, good. That way we can use Ember if this doesn't kill it. But it did. As I knew it would. Great job, Charmeleon. It was a crit, my word. Okay. 162. Eevee's level 24. Nice. Eevee wants to learn takedown? Again, I don't like recoil damage. Nidorina's level 23. Toxic on Nidorina? Yes, please. What is it now? Double kick, bite, dig, and poison sting? Honestly, Toxic is more useful than Poison Sting, because Poison Sting is literally 15 power, which is absurd. By the time you use three Poison Stings, three turns of Toxic will have done more damage, so... And I'll write you. Will you switch? Yes, I'm going to switch back to Ivysaur, get the uh, Leech Seed off, maybe do a Poison Powder, even though they'll probably have a full Restore or a full Heal. So, maybe not the Poison Powder, especially if it kills uh, Ivysaur. Leech Seed, there we go. Thunderbolt, don't kill me or paralyze me. That's all I ask. No, it paralyzed me! Don't, don't get paralyzed. Yes, okay. We got the Leech Seed off. That's fine. Because that's staying on for the whole rest of the battle. That will help the entirety of the team. Uh, you know what? I feel like switching to Nidorina and using Toxic. That's what I feel like doing. We're gonna see if it works out. If it doesn't, eh, could be worse. Thunderbolt. Oh, okay, that didn't work out. <laughs> We're gonna lose Nidorina for sure. But, uh, we're slowly whittling it down with Leech Seed health, so that's... That's something, right? Toxic? Yeah, we're gonna die. Okay. Well, in that case, we'll just, uh, go right to Eevee. Man, oh man. I wish we had a Ground-type. I guess we could have had Geodude. But... I think Geoda is literally the only ground type we've seen so far. Swift! Thunderbolt. Yikes! That did almost half. Okay, that was a crit. If it has a healing item, it's going to be used now. Which is not great for us. But, uh, what are you going to do? Oh, no healing item. Okay, we're in business. Nice. Okay, we'll take it out for sure. Not bad, not bad. Again, this is not a Nuzlocke, so we still have Nidorina, which is good. But, uh... So far, I think only two Pokemon have fainted in the whole playthrough. You went on Water Gun at level 20? I mean, I'm going to teach it over Bubble, but man, alive. Get it together, War Turtle. You should have known Water Gun ages ago. Use level 22. Not bad. Amnesia. Huh. Must have forgotten that move. 
Um, we're no, we're not gonna use it. Wow, that's a shocker! You're the real deal, kid. We got a lot of money for that. Ready for another high five, Evie? Fine then, take the thunder badge. Boom! You got a thunder badge from Lieutenant Surge. And that's not all. You're special, kid. Take this. Really? Lieutenant Surge's autograph? What's that gonna... <laughs> Don't worry, that's not all I'm giving you. We got Thunderbolt. Oh, yeah. I don't think Thunderbolt was Team 36, but that hardly matters, so... Containing the Electrifying Thunderbolt. Teach it to an Electro-type Pokemon for some extra shock value. A little word of advice, kid. Electro-type moves are sure powerful. But remember that they'll get sucked right up by Ground-type Pokemon. Those moves are useless against them. Let's talk to Eevee. Eevee looks exhausted from how nervous it was. Ah, oh, pet the Eevee. Good, Eevee. You did great in the gym, Eevee. You defeated, uh, the Raichu. With a little help from Ivysaur, of course. Our name is immortalized on this, uh, statue. That was- that match was electric! It was so blinding, I'm still seeing stars! So many puns all around, guys. So many puns. <clears throat> okay. <gasps> Misty's over there! What does Misty want? I do need to heal, mind you. Still have a fainted need arena in the party. Oh, it's you again! Oh, wow, you beat Lieutenant Surge? You must be good. I did beat you. Glad to see you're really learning a thing or two. And your Pokemon must have tried their best. Misty healed your team! Oh! Thanks, Misty. That's, uh, that saves me a lot of trouble from going up there. Oh, me? I go swimming in the sea. There are times when you just want to break free from a little puny pool and swim in the big blue. Where are you headed next? Have you been to Diglett's Cave? It's pretty close by. If you haven't been, I could show you the way there. Want a guide? I'll walk with you, Misty. Great then, let's go. Let's go, Eevee. Oh, it's not, okay. <clears throat> Wasn't that pleasant. This is Diglett's cave. Diglett dug out this cave path all on their own. Okay, see ya. Be sure to meet lots of Pokemon. You mean like Diglett? Um. Okay, we'll go in the cave and catch a Diglett. Uh, put, uh, War Turtle back in front for battling purposes. Hello, sir. Well, I'll be. Do you know this is a huge, long tunnel? This was dug entirely by Diglett. Yeah, I figured that out. Okay, so Diglett's gonna be here for sure. Oh, gotta catch a Diglett. Um, the first time I played Red version... I, uh, it was very late, it was, uh, after I got a DS, I think, but my friend was, uh, they were getting rid of a Game Boy Advance SP, and my other friend was, just gave me his old red version, so, uh, I played through it, and right at the end of this tunnel, Right before Surge, I caught a Dugtrio with a Great Ball, and it was like three levels higher than my highest Pokemon at the time, and it carried me through. Diglett, the Mole Pokemon. It prefers dark places. It spends most of its time underground, though it may pop up in caves. Caves are also underground, are they not? Item? No. Okay. Item? No. Okay. Be on the lookout for Dugtrio, is what I'm saying. I know there's supposed to be Diglett here, but we could find a Dugtrio. There's a tiny Diglett. I guess Eevee's tail will wag if there are items here. I don't have to actually check. No? 
Okay, so... Nothing... yet. But this does give us the chance to, uh... cut down the tree and stuff uh, up here by Pewter and go the other way that we haven't been before. I've heard that there's a tunnel even darker inside than this one somewhere. Yeah, it's a rock tunnel. And I'm not looking forward to that, but, uh... You know, we'll make it one day. Route 2. Good to be back. Pre... Ah, Great Balls. Interesting. Okay. We'll, uh, go around this way. Hello. Oh, Caleb! Remember me? I'm one of Professor X's assistants. I'm so glad I ran into you. Why don't I show you a neat trick? Actually, no. It's a little too bright out here. Inside. I'll be waiting inside to show you whenever you're ready, Caleb. Um, so is he going to teach me Flash right now? Is that a thing? So you came! Then let's get down to brass tacks. I've got something good to show you. Believe it or not... Yes, okay, so it is Flash. I've mastered the secret technique, light up! Now, let me turn off the lights and... There, nice and dark. Now, if you calm your heart and breathe deeply, you'll be able to sense your surroundings no matter how dark it is. See? It seems bright, even with the lights off. My keen focus spreads those to all around me. Here, I can teach it to you. Evie wants to learn it. Huh? It seems Evie wants to learn it instead. But you can't teach us both. You say Evie knows the secret technique chop down? I see, Professor Oak had mentioned it, but it never but it really does seem that your Eevee is special. Fascinating. Let me try to teach it. Here, let me turn off the lights again. Now, Eevee, follow what I told you, calm your heart, breathe deeply, sense your surroundings. Eevee is now Daredevil, confirmed. Nice. Okay. Your Eevee really is quite wonderful. Now your secret techniques are your heart content. Since they're not moves, you can use them even if your Pokemon doesn't have energy to battle or fainted. You can see through Rock Tunnel if you use the secret technique light up. You know where Rock Tunnel is? Yes, I do. I do know where Rock Tunnel is. Uh, so, I'm glad we came here, actually, because we needed that, for sure. Oh, Tracy! Did you learn light up? Yes, I did. What? You didn't learn it, but it Well, okay, Evie did. That partner of yours really is amazing, Caleb. Hey, you know what? I actually know some place where you might be able to use it. No. What? No! I don't want to... There's still stuff around here. Yeah, I want to go alone. For sure. I know where Rock Tunnel is, you imbecile. Plus, I wanted to go to the route that's... To the east of Vermilion. I didn't want to just not go there at all. Oh, hello, Coach Trainer. CP stands for combat power. Whoa, combat! Ha! <laughs> Fatality! Hello, kid. People who can use secret techniques are so cool, aren't they? Can you use them? My Eevee can. And I own my Eevee, so... That makes me extra cool. Free thing? A Leaf Stone? Yeah. No thanks, Tracy. I'm not gonna follow you all the way back there. I would've missed out on a Leaf Stone, for crying out loud. Super Potion. Nice. Okay. I guess that's all. All the things. So, a quick jaunt back through Diglett's Cave will result in us uh, back in Vermilion. Uh, I guess... No, okay. The best way to do this is definitely going back through Diglett's Cave. 
Because otherwise you would have to go all the way back through Mount Moon. And we are not doing that. Uh, but through Diglett's Cave is fine. And then uh, up to Cerulean again through the Dark Tunnel. Rock Tunnel, I mean. There's a Zubat in here. Okay. Do, 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 do. There's a huge uh, diglet. And on the huge ones, there's like kind of a yellow swirl involved. On the fringe parts of it. There's a Dugtrio! Nice! Nice! I knew there would be a Dugtrio in here. Anyway, um, the, the fringe yellow parts on the huge one always throws me off because if I recall correctly uh, the shiny thing is yellow but there's also stars around it I just haven't seen that yet so nice I can't believe we caught it Doug Trio we probably could have come in here and caught a diglet before the electric gym and used it maybe but eh Ivy Store's level 24. Oh boy. <clears throat> Dugtrio, the mole Pokemon. A team of triplets that can burrow to a depth of 60 miles. It's reported that it triggers an earthquake. Alright, not bad. Not bad, not bad at all. That means we don't ever have to come back to Diglett's cave because we successfully caught a Diglett and a Dugtrio. So, I'm going to go this way. I know we'll get cut off. A coach trainer. Okay. Wait a minute. I want to catch that drowsy. Drowsy. You're mine, drowsy. Give me those jazz fingers. Eh. We're gonna, we are going to use a berry, but I'm going to use a regular Pokeball. At least to start off. I used it on the trio because it was in evolved form, but uh, I didn't mean to do that. That's what I meant to do. Excellent throw. Come on. <laughs> yep. Got the drowsy. Now oh, Charmeleon leveled up. Nice. Added the data to the decks. Drowsy, the hypnosis Pokemon. If you sleep by it all the time, it will sometimes show you dreams it had eaten in the past. That's nice of it, I guess, to remind you of dreams that it consumed against your will. There's another Rattata. Uh, there's a free item. A super potion. Not bad. There's a Pidgey. Okay. Oh! Okay. Avoided the Rattata skillfully. I'm gonna battle this coach trainer. Do you like Route 11? The double ones in its name... The double ones in its name are so cool. And guess what? I'm the coach trainer on Route Double One. This guy's kind of lame. <laughs> I won't hold back. Yeah, this guy's kind of lame. Route Double One. That's not what it is. Coach trainer will... Tenaldo Rattata? Are you kidding me? It's not even a Lolan. Alright, War Turtle, you can definitely handle this jump. Use a quick scald, and we'll be good. Super. Avoided the Super Fang! That's what I like to see. Okay, maybe, uh. Maybe not as quick as I thought. It looks like it did a lot, but it always does half, so I'm not too worried about it. Did I get the burn? Yes! Got the burn! Okay. With that, I'm going to switch it up, and uh, I'm going to actually use Dig. Because now that it's burned, it will get uh, two turns of burn damage. And I will avoid attack. I'm glad it, uh, I'm glad it knows Dig. We avoided Crunch, 
Use dig. I didn't do a whole lot. I'm sorry I insulted you for only having a Rattata, because it's actually doing a pretty decent job for you. We'll use dig again, because uh, we're going to have to go and heal after this anyway, so... Okay. And we will definitely take it out with dig burn combination. Avoid the crunch. Use the dig. Rattata goes bye-bye. But what uh, what goodies are we going to get from this coach trainer? They always give out prizes. You're strong. I hope it's a TM. You're strong. You've got me in good mood, so take these. Five Eevee candies. Interesting. If you want to use an Eevee candy, Eevee will get much stronger. If you want to get candy for a specific Pokemon, try catching that species over and over or send them to the professor. Um, we're going to figure out what that means right now. I assume it's just like Pokemon Go. Candy is packed with energy. When given to a certain Pokemon, it will increase all their stats at once. Yes, please. Holy hoss, look at that. I'll take it. I mean, we might as well use it all, right? I mean, there's no reason not... I mean, it's not like we're going to get another Eevee to use it on or anything. Okay, so... I think that is a good episode. Um, we will go back and fight the rest of the trainers on Route Double One, as the coach trainer calls it, the next time. And then we will uh, presumably make our way up to Rock Tunnel. Uh, I doubt we'll get through Rock Tunnel all in one go, but uh, it's worth a shot. So, uh, glad we beat Surge. And uh, be sure and answer the Inquisition down in the comments. Also, be sure to leave a like, share this video, and subscribe so that you too can become an Imperial today. And we'll see you around next time.